The other day I got to go to Chick-fil-A here in town and I'm telling you their drive through is incredible. The way and the speed at which they get you what you want is mind blowing. A lot of times I, I think we wish that um, we could just simply connect with people like that and just go, here's what I want, boom, and you get it. Um, now obviously that is exactly what we get in our culture with so much things, but prayer is uh, something that we wish was more like that. Sometimes I think we think, hey man, I'm praying for this thing and God doesn't answer. I'm praying for this thing and God doesn't give it to me. And I want to pause and, and give you a scripture from the book of First John chapter 5. John's just told us we can be confident that we have eternal life. And then he says this, and this is the confidence that we have toward him, meaning God, Jesus, that if we ask anything according to his will, he hears us. And if we know that he hears us and whatever we ask, we know we have the requests that we have asked of him. You know, a lot of our prayer life, to be quite honest, is like the requests of a child to a parent. My kids are constantly asking me for things that honestly is not good for their life or that they don't understand we can't afford or that's just impossible to get. And I have to say no. But when they are connected with the, my desire for their life, when they're connected with my thinking and what I know is good for them and stuff, and they ask me for something, it's an easy yes every single time. That's the th same thing for us. As we have eternal life and God abides within us and we know Him and we're enjoying His Word and we understand what He desires, here's what it says. If we ask according to His will, then He hears us. He's listening. It's not bouncing off the walls. He's right with us right now. He hears us and we can be confident that He's going to give us those requests. If we know that He hears us in whatever we ask, because it'll be according to his will, we know that we have the requests that we've asked of him. You can leave. Now, that doesn't mean it's going to come today. It may come weeks later. It may come months later, but God hears us. So I want this to fuel your prayer life right now. What are the things that you're asking for? And don't, don't, don't just make it about like, am I really in God's will or not? You'll learn as you go forward, asking for God for the things that you need and you desire. And when it's in his will, he's going to give it to you. Otherwise, just pray and ask him. Be confident that he loves you, that he's shaping you, that he's putting these desires in your heart so that you can ask him. Be confident in your prayers today. Go to him and ask. Now watch as he begins to answer. And then thank him. Celebrate. Because our God hears.